Hello and welcome to another Daddy Jang's Field.web.com video tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you some good Google and Firefox add-ons that are good to have. I'm going to show you a, a real quick uh, tip for you for your Firefox browser. Uh, first of all, I'll open up my Firefox browser. And as you might see, I got little pictures right here beside all my links right here. You think, oh, those are just videos. No, they're not videos. They're actually pictures of each uh, uh, website that I'm looking at here. And this program is called Google Preview. And it pretty much shows you a preview of the website that you're getting ready to click on. Um, so basically what you do is go to Google and you type in Google Preview. And you hit search. And then should be your first link right here as you can see it's you see a little picture right there and you see that's the correct site so we're going to click on that and it's going to take you to the Firefox side on and basically all you have to do is click on add to Firefox and it should install it into your add-ons here and then it's going to ask you to restart your computer and just go ahead and restart your computer and then go ahead and go on Google and search search for something and I'll give you a preview with it. Uh, let me go ahead and quickly tell you about a few other add-ons that I have. Um, I also have a program called FastDial. Uh, FastDial is a really good program. Uh, later, let me show you what it is. Okay, here is FastDial. Now of course you can, it doesn't come with this background, it's normally all white background. Uh, but you're going to end up changing by right clicking and going to preference. Oh, wow, we got it up. There you go. Now, once in preference, you go to, uh, well, in general, you can change how many uh, blocks you see here. How many, you know, wide and stuff like that. And then you can go to appearance. And if you go to page and then to image, you can pick whatever image you want in the background. Or if you don't want an image, uh, it, it would take the image off. Uh, actually, I just center the Im image and not repeat it. And that's the actual size of an image. But uh, let's say you don't want an image, you know, you just delete what's in the image field and it gives you an all black background or whatever color you like by pressing right here. And it gives you a choice of what color you want to do it in. Okay. And that's fast now. Now, um, let's see what else we got here. Internet Explorer tab. Okay, the IE tab is for Internet Explorer tab. It'll pretty much open up like a tab that's that runs like Internet Explorer, so that you can you know control whatever whatever that is that needs Internet Explorer to run. Link notification. Link notification is a pretty good add-on too. Uh, what it does is pretty much. Anytime you see a link on a web page or something like that that's not highlighted, well, it'll pretty much automatically highlight it so that all you have to do is just click instead of copy and paste. Uh, then, of course, I like to have a mini Nova 2 bar and then a program called Time Tracker, which is right down in here. It pretty much tracks how long you've been on that internet page. Of course, it's not doing anything right now because I'm not on a website. Now that I'm on a website, it's going to track how long uh, I've been on here. Okay, there you go. And I think that's pretty much all the add-ons I have right now. You can also get a, a few additional add-ons, uh, like if you want to change the theme of your uh, of your Firefox browser. Let's say if you want to change the theme of it. Uh, okay, and it gives us a few choices here. And you can search for some more. You just go to all themes and just, you know, search for the themes. Uh, sometimes it'll let you know if uh, it, you can't use it for whatever version uh, Firefox you have. It'll let you know that you can't use it for it. But, uh, well, that's it. And that's all the tips I have for Oh, Also, I wanted to mention, I got a few of these ideas from um, a gentleman called uh, Jigsaw. And I'll show you his website in a second. Okay, here's his channel right here. And his name is uh, Jigsaw555555XX. Five, 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 uh, what his site is mostly about is about, you know, computer hacking. Uh, if you want to learn how to uh, hack some stuff. Um, he has a few good uh, 
tutorials on it and stuff like that. He doesn't talk on his tutorials. Uh, you pretty much have to read most of his tutorials and stuff. But they are pretty good and informative. But uh, I got a few uh, add-on ideas from him. Anyways, uh, that's it for this quick tutorial. Well, that's it for this tutorial. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to leave them. If you like my videos and you want to uh, support them, you can do so by subscribing or donating. If you want to subscribe and you're watching my video, you can click right here to subscribe. If you want to donate, click on the more info section and click on the first link. If you're on my YouTube channel, you can click right here at the first link right there. Uh, and click right here if you want to subscribe. If you're not on YouTube and you want to donate, you can go to daddychangefilms.webs.com and then click on the links button. It'll take you to my links page. And on this page is a bunch of other uh, links to other softwares that you can try. Um, but you can go right here where it says please donate and it'll take you to my donate page. And you can click right here to donate. Hope you enjoy my tutorial and have a nice day.